Namaste. Welcome to Preeti's Bar Yoga Pilates and Pranayam class. I welcome you all with full energy and I welcome to you above all with for your me time. With that, we start a nice warm up, swing our arms. Very good. Arms are going round and up. Little higher, warming up our shoulders, warming up our arms. Today our focus is more on the arms. So let's make a circle. Keep the knees going, keep the march going. Two more times. Beautiful. Let's reverse it. Yes, it is helping us with our lumbar spine and opening our chest for the oxygen. So good, good job. Very good. Last time, Chris. And when you go open back, push it back. Yes. Three more times. Oh, it's in the house. Welcome, baby. Give a shout, Nina Gatcher. Last one. Slowly bringing it down. Stop your feet. And give a nice neck roll. One, two, and three, one more reverse time. One, two, and three. Good job, child. Take that knee, give a nice hug. Hold it one, two, and three. Put all your weight on the right. Look down, find a spot and hold it. One, two, and three. Very good. Now, my friends, make genie arms. Genie arms, and we will rotate, center, Rotate center, but with that, we will lift up our knees. We will warm up our hip flexors and our lumbar spine. Very good. One more round. Nice, nicely done. And let's swing our legs. Hold your hand on your waist and swing, swing, swing. Two more times. And come on back. Ready for the other side? Let's go. One, two, three, four, and five. Yes, good job. Let's give a nice soft run. Just a little bit of heat in our body. And then we're going to start with our Surya Namaskar. So let's get ready for Surya Namaskar. Meeting me at the front edge of our mat, I will be facing you so that you can see me properly. With that, we do pranam asana, where we fold our hands, we close our eyes, we set up an intent for today and today, wherever you are, whatever brought you for today's class, Promise yourself a commitment for the next one hour, giving you a hundred percent with a beautiful smile, opening up your eyes. Ready? Let's go. That's the Uttan Asana. The biceps are closer to the ears. Pull yourself up so that you feel a stretch in your abdomen. Now bring your hips forward and bring your head back. Do not drop your head like this. And hold it for one, two, make it prayer hands. And imagine there's a coffee cup at the back. And keep going down slowly. Now drop the top of your head all the way down. And hold it. You can bend your knees if you need to. That's absolutely fine. Hold it. Almost like you're ready to lift up your heels. All the weights on your toes. And from here, slowly, right leg back, left leg forward. Now you can drop your knees for Ashwa Sanjana, or you can keep it straight up. Hold it for one, two, bringing the left leg back, coming toward Dandasana. Plank. This is excellent for osteoporosis to make our bones stronger. One, two, slowly, dropping down the knees, flipping. You can go back. This is called Ashtangana, where eight of our limbs are in work. One, two, slowly getting ready. 
to come to Bhujangasana, Cobra. This helps to reduce high blood pressure. One, two, curl up your toes, lift up your knees, bring your hips back, back, back. You can walk your legs forward and hold it. One, two, slowly bring the right leg back forward, left leg back, hold it. One, two, back to Hasta Uttanasana, where the toes and fingers meet. One, two, slowly come on up. Prana Asana, bending those elbows, push the elbows back, hip forward. One, two, slowly lift up, come back to Pranamasana. Ready for the left side? Let's quickly jump into the left side. Ready? Lift yourself up, hip forward. One, two, four counts down. Coming down slowly. Trying to drop the top of our head. Bend your knees and hold it for one, two. Right leg back, left leg forward. One, two. Send the left leg back. Hands are underneath your shoulders. One, two. Drop your knees. Look at my feet. I lift up and I flip it. Scoot back. And come drop the chin. Stomach is up in the air. One, two, straightening up yourself and coming to Bhujangasana. Over here for further challenge, you can even lift up your knees. It's upward dog. Now curl up your toes, lifting up your knees and send your hips up and back from here. Walk one step forward and hold it for one, two, right leg up. Bring it forward, hold it. One, two, back to Hasta Padahastana, where the toes and fingers meet. One, two, slowly come on up. Lift up yourself, bend those elbows, push the elbows back. One, two, slowly come on up. And namaste. Real quickly, again, we will do one more set of. Suri Namaskar, we will go a little faster. Ready? One, two, one down, Padahasana. One, two, right leg back, left leg forward. Ash, Ashwasanchalan. Slowly send the left leg back. Do not drop your hips or do not lift it up. Straight line. One, Two, drop your knees, flip your feet, chin your chest to the mat, elbows back. One, two, straighten up yourself for cobra. One, two, cut up your toes, lift up your knees, lift up your hips, send it back, send it back. From here, walk your feet one step forward, dropping the heel for one, two, lift up the right leg, bring it forward now. One, Two, back to Padahastana where the toes and fingers meet. One, two, slowly coming up, bending those elbows, the hips forward for one, two, straighten yourself up, and Namaste. Ready for the left side? Let's hit it. Lifting up yourself. One, two, your hands four counts down, dropping the top of our head, bending your knees for one, two, right leg back, left leg forward. Excellent, my dear friends. One, two, coming to plank, the nasana. This is strengthening your shoulders, your upper back. Now drop your knees. Ashtangana to open up our Swadishtana Chakra. Drop your chin, elbows back. One, two, straighten up yourself. One, two, curl up your toes, lift up your knees, send the hips back. From here, walk your legs forward. One, two, lift up the right leg, bring the right knee forward. One, two, Slowly come on up, let your toes and fingers meet. 
Bending the knees for one, two, and slowly coming up one vertebrae at a time. Bend those elbows, push the elbows back with the shoulder blades and squeezing for one, two, slowly straighten up yourself and one stay. Sunan, my dear friends, very good. Are you ready for some Baba Ramde? Oblique exercise to strengthen ourselves. We will love this. So, what we are going to do is grabbing our Pilates ring. If you don't have a Pilates ring, you can use a ball. But I think it's about time we all invest in our Pilates ring. Yes, it's a great investment. It will help you to strengthen upper body, inner thighs, everything. So my dear friends, legs are hip width apart, arms go up, and all I want to do is take, take, talk, very good. Take, talk, take, talk, very good. Five, four, Three, two, last one, last one, finish your round, bring it in, bring your legs back again. Now, bring the elbows up, drop the elbows. Elbows up, drop the elbows. One more time, elbows up, drop the elbows. This time, keep the elbows lifted. Ring is not touching your body, it's a little far away. And all I'm doing is coming on my big toe of my right leg, or I lift up the leg and I press it for eight counts. One, two, three, four. Squeeze the belly button, squeeze the belly button. Last two, last two, and last one. Slowly dropping that leg. Drop your ring. Come back up again on your left big toe or you lift up the leg. And if you have lifted up the leg, look down, look at one spot, do not move. And ready, eight counts. Eight, seven, six, squeezing the belly button. Last, five, four, three, two, last one, slowly. Right. All right, now my dear friends, Let's leave the ring and open up your legs more than hip width apart. Now, bend your knees as do not lean forward, do not lean back. It's as if it's a straight line. So if you're watching, straight up, straight down. And when you come up, do not lock your knees. So keep a soft bend. Do not lock it like that. This is lock. So I'm keeping a soft bend. Good job. Good job, Rina Gajar. Very good, Rina One, two, and three. And meet me down. Hands behind your head. And keep it. Stay down only now. Now, right elbow to the right knee. Come up. Elbow to the left knee. Are you ready? Let's go. One, two, three. Good job, Rina. Four. Five, six, seven. The legs are not moving. Legs are not moving. Eight. Come on, come on, come on. Nine. Last one. And last one. Slowly come on up. Excellent, excellent. Very quickly grab one weight. One weight. Cross your leg, left hand behind your head, and I'm going to dip towards my right. So I'm holding my weight like this with my first two fingers. And I dip and I come halfway up. I don't come all the way up this time, okay? Ready? You dip, you come a little bit up. Only a few inches up and you go back down again. You dip and up. Halfway up. Halfway up. Very good, very good, good job. Five, good job, Renuka Ben, good job. 
four, three, two, last one, slowly switching it, hands behind, everything will have an effect. If not today, then tomorrow, all the way down, become halfway up. All the way down, halfway up. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one, slowly coming up. What a good job we did. Yes, now my dear friends, are you all ready to do some strengthening of our hips and our inner thighs? For that, I would like you to grab your band and meet me, your resistant band and meet me down in the, on the floor. Grab your um, Pilates ring also, please. I don't know what I'm going to use, but you never know. So, again, make sure you have your favorite towels next to you. The short one goes underneath your neck and the long one to support your lower back. And then we will first sit on our elbows. So you can move your towel if you need to, as if you're watching TV. As if you're watching TV. I bend your left knee. Shoulders are square, okay? Now, straight leg up, straight leg down. One count up, two counts down. One count up, down, down. One count up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down. Last time, up, down, down. Now this time, my dear friends, when you bring it up, rotate your feet. So my toes are straight. Now my toes are facing outwards from here. I only lift it up, lift, 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 very good. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Keep it lifted from your mid circles, small circles. Circle one, two, three. Do not drop, no matter what, do not drop your leg, do not drop your leg. This is when the change happens. Ready to reverse? Reverse one, two, three, four. Very good, Suhas. Good job, Nina Ben. Continue, Malini Ben. And last two, last one, and slowly drop it. Very good. Now, before we switch to the other side, I want you to come on your back. Once you're on your back, take your ring, and put it in between your thighs. Once it's in between your thighs, I want you to come up with your bridges, say to bund, come up and slowly come down, squeeze the ring for one squeeze. Slowly come up, squeeze the ring for two. One, two, come down, squeeze the ring for three. One, two, Three, come up, squeeze the ring for four. One, two, three, drop the hip, squeeze it for five. One, two, three, four, five. Hold the hips up, squeeze six, five, four, three, two, one, drop, squeeze seven, six, five, four, three, two, what lift up last one eight seven six five four three two one slowly come down good job take the ring up real quickly bring both the knees 
to your chest and give a side to side massage for your back. Once you have done that, drop your legs. Hold your rig. Lift up the right, first bring both the hips up. Sorry, bring both the hips up and hold it. Now take the right leg, bring it up or keep it here, wherever you are today. If you cannot keep a straight leg, bend your knee. And all I want you to do is push up only from your left leg. Push one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Slowly drop it. You can drop your hands. And one more time, we bring both our hips up. Hands are up. Leg is up or bend wherever you are. And you push, you push, you push, putting all the weight on your right heel. For five, four, three, two, last one. Slowly bring it down. And you did a good job. One more time. Let's roll up and come on up on your left side. As if we're going to do the left one. So again, both the knees are bent. And I straighten up my left leg. And I slowly go up, coming back. So one count down, two counts up. Down, one, two. Down, one, two. Down, one. If your shoulders are hurting, you can go like this one. So keeping the abs working. Two counts down. One up. Two counts down now. One up. Two counts down. One more time. Single count up. And two counts down. This time when you're up, my dear friends, flip your feet. Toes are facing outside. Now lift up. For 10, 9, 8, Seven, six, five, four, three. Don't let it go. Don't let it go. We're going to do the circles. Ready? Circle one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ready to reverse? Ready to reverse? Reverse eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Slowly drop it. Keep a nice one more time. Roll neck, your knees side to side. And now this time swing up. And my dear friends, what we are going to do is a little bit of our side inner thighs. So I'm going to be on my right side. And I'm going to straighten up my leg. And I'm going to wear my bend. Let's wear your bend. Wear your bend. You can be on your elbow or you can be like this, wherever you are. And the top leg is up. Pull, pull your bend and hold it. One, two, three. Very good. From here, only hold it up. Push it up. We're working on our outer thighs, our abductors. One, abduct two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Slowly walk, lift up both the legs and walk, walk back and front as if you're walking. See how much your abdomen gets engaged. Yes, pull it back and forth, pull the bed. Walk two more times. Walk, walk, last one, walk and walk. Very good, drop it. Swing yourself up. Let's go on the other side. Right leg is up and I'm going to stretch first my bend. See how much I can stretch it. Once I stretch it, I lift up. I do not go forward or back. So keep your hand in front of your chest for one, two, three, four, five. No matter what, do not drop your leg. Do not drop your leg. Two more times, two and one. Now again, walk, 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 walk. Walk, walk, four, three, two, last one, 
slowly drop it and let it go. Real quickly, come on your back and let's do some windshield wiper, Markatasan. So you drop your knees and you drop it on the left side. Drop it on the right side. This is an excellent exercise for our waist. It will shrink our waistline. So please continue. Very good. Two more counts. One. And two. And slowly swing yourself up. Getting ready for a quick upper body exercise. For upper body exercise, we are going to have fun. Grab your weights and real quickly give me a march. Quick march, quick march. Weights are doing nothing. Just leave it. Leave it in your arms. You don't have to even have your weights. If you don't want, you don't have to have your weights. Now watch what I'm doing. Out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, little faster. So don't go too much up, small, small moves. Very good. Down, up, in, in, out, up, in, in, out, up, in, in, out, up, in, in, out, up, in, in. You can lift up your knees, you can do whatever you want. Three more counts. Bring the heart rate up. Good for your cardio. Last one. And slowly come on up. Excellent, my dear friends. Now, one more time, we're going to wear our bends above your knee. Bends are above our knee. Grab your weights. And once we grab our waist, all I'm doing is bringing my arms up. I squat down, I overhead, and then I come back, I come in. Left leg out, both arms up. I stop at my shoulder line, then I come in. Right leg out, overhead, stop at the shoulder line, Come in, left, up, shoulders, in. Ready? You're on your own now. Yes, I want your brain to think. Very good. Good job. Two more counts are coming up. Last two. Last one. Excellent, excellent. Now, my dear friends, what I want you to do is, with your bend, you're going to hinge forward. Keep, you can take, keep the bend or you can take it out. Okay, let's put the bend. Let's bring the bend over ankles. Stretch it a little bit. Keep the stretch going, bring your arms. Look at my arms are not up, not down. Straight line. Give me circles. One, two, three, four. Keep the bend stretch. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one, ready to reverse? Reverse one. Don't drop your arms no matter what. That's when the change happens. Only for five more, four more. Three, two, one. Guess what? Flip it up in as if you're bouncing a ball. One, two, three. Bounce it up, bounce it up, bounce it up, bounce it up. Four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Now flip your head, bounce it down as if you're flying. Two. Three, four, do not give up. Drop your weights if you need to, but do not give up, do not give up. Last one, slowly bring it in. Ooh, that was a good one, wasn't it? Now let's take the bend out, take a break from the weight. That doesn't mean that we're not coming back to the weights. Grab your ball. 
grab your ball, stand like me, facing one side, hold the ball, the ball has no value, okay? Now we go right leg back, hands are up. Now bring the ball to the knee in the front. Bring the ball to the knee and go back. Bring the ball to the knee and go back. Are you ready, my dear friends? Yes, let's hit it. Everybody, come on, let's go. Ball to the knee, ball to the knee. Three, four, this is working our abdomen, working our shoulders. When we push our legs back every single time, not only our abs are working, but our glutes are working too. Very good, last four, three, two, last one. Slowly bring it in. Roll the shoulders, one, as you're turning, two, and three, reverse. One, two, and three. This time, left leg is out. We bring the ball to the knee. Out, ball to the knee. Out, ball to the knee. Are you ready? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. Excellent. We did it, didn't we? Very good. Let's take a break from the ball. Last exercise for our upper body. You're doing good. You are doing absolutely good. Very good. Now what I want you to do is, all we are doing is, again, a knee lift. Arms are straight. We bring halfway up, and we march. Knee lift. Very good. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Good job, Pinky, this side. Very good. Keep it going. Last one. Finish your leg. Finish your leg. Excellent. Now keep your hands right here. Right here. See how L shape it is? Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift up my right leg. I'm going to come to a three position. Relax and then just bounce. Open the book first, uh, sideways. Open the book sideways and let's bounce it. 10, 9, 8, 7. You don't have to do the leg. You can keep the legs down. Yes, bounce the body. Bounce the body. Come up and then don't go down too much. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Squeeze the belly. 10. Slowly drop it. Don't drop the arms. Don't drop the arms. Now look down at one spot. Come back to the tree asana. And then from here, only micro bend down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent. I promise you, last one. Hands in front of here. Bring it under the chin. See how my elbows are opening? And I come down, elbows facing up and down. One, two, three, four, five. Come on up, stay up. Only. From here, push it up. Two, three, four, five. Flap, 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 flap your wings, flap your wings, flap your wings. Four, three, two, and one. We did it, didn't we? Are you all ready for a little lower body exercise? And then we hit our pranayam and we go. So coming back. Keep your bend next to you, my dear friends. Don't forget that the bend is next to you. And lay down. Bring your towels. Now. Do a butterfly feet. What is a butterfly feet? Both the feet are touching each other. Yes. Hands are on your side and drop your butterfly feet. Look up straight to the ceiling. Hands are on the side. Open up your fingers if you need to. Again, all I'm doing is, uh, you cannot arch your back, okay? So all I'm doing is I lift up only this much where my back is not arching and I drop it down. Now, if you don't want to touch the mat, you don't have to touch the yoga mat. Ready? Lift up. Slow drop. Now, if you cannot touch your feet, 
Then keep it wide or keep it straight like this. And then you come up and slow down. You lift up and slow down. But coming back to butterfly for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Keep it up. Keep your head up. Keep your head up. Keep the butterfly up. If you're like this, then keep your legs bent. Or if you're in butterfly, keep the butterfly up. And only bring your chest up and down. Legs are not doing anything for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. Slowly drop it, close it, and then give a nice side to side roll. Good job. Very good. Real quickly, dropping your legs, bringing your heads under, hands underneath. Lift up the right leg. Point your toes. Flex your feet. Point your toes. Flex your feet. Point. Flex. Keep it pointed. Ready for our circles. Nice big letter O. And very gracefully. Again, working on our lower abdomen. Very good. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Remember, on the top, you breathe in. Circle down. Breathe out. Circle in. Breathe in. Circle up, breathe up one more. And come back to the top, ready to reverse. When you drop your leg, you breathe in and you drop, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Last five, four, three, two. Last one, and slowly bend that knee, give a nice hug, straighten up your left leg, come up to kiss it, and slowly, slowly drop your feet, bending the right knee, lifting up the left leg, hands underneath your hips, and you point and you flex, point, flex, point, flex, keep it pointed, ready, Take a deep breath in and breathe out. When you come up, breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Five more times. Five, four, three, two, last one. Finish it, finish it, finish it. Ready for the circle reverse? So when you drop your feet, breathe in. Breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, in, out. Close your eyes, in, out, in, out. Five more, five more. Last five, four, three, two, last one. Slowly bring that knee in, straightening up your right leg, coming up to kiss it. Slowly grab, grab your bend, put your bend right on your arches. The bend is on my arch, hands behind your head. My knees are bent, hands are behind your head. Knees is bent, and all I'm doing is stretching. Stretch the bend, switch, stretch. Head is up, head is up. So we are holding our abdomen muscle, and all I'm doing is stretching the bend to my arch. Very good. Last four, three, two. Last one, one, one more set, one more set. And one, slowly drop your head, remove the bend, and let's do a quick waist trimmer, Murkat Asan, windshield wipers. So both knees on one side, and you flip it to the other side. Ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 
five, four, three, two, one. Excellent, my dear friends. Very good. Slowly swing yourself up and let's quickly sit up. This time, let's move on. Me. Open up your legs. We open up our legs, hands behind the head, and we touch, rotate side to side. Ready? Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, last two, last two, last one, and last one. Very good. Good job. Real quickly, give me a butterfly spine. Is straight, swinging it nicely for five, four, three, two. Everyone is doing a wonderful job. I'm so proud of everyone. Yes, slowly bring it in. And one more time, we go back to our squat. So this time, when we are here, yes. Very good. We lift up both the knees. We drop the knees. We lift up both the knees and we drop. One more time. Lift up and stay up for one, two, three, four. Slowly drop the right, drop the left. You can continue with your stretch Why I decided to pakav you. Yes, my dear friends. It is that time of the class where... We start heading to meditation. Not only we start heading to meditation, but before that, we get into pranayam. But my today's pakao time for all of you. The quote says, it's an Afghani quote. And the quote says that what you see in yourself what you see in yourself, that is how you see the world. So, if you see good in yourself, you're satisfied with yourself, you're contented, you're thankful, then you will see everything around you being happy, appreciated, and being thankful. But, if you see negative, you know what happens when if you see negative, right? So from today, let's see the goodness instead of criticizing. Even at the restaurant we go, we make we are so picky with even our water. Oh, ice mat lekarana, thanda mat lana, room temperature lana, garam. Oh my God. Let's be satisfied. Let's be a little more flexible. Instead of straining. Now, what happened is in that restaurant, now you created. Just a negative vibe between vibes between you and the waiter. My dear friends, let's see the strength in ourselves. Once you feel stronger, you'll feel the world very happier. You'll feel a lot of joy and a lot of goodness if you see things positively. So from today, refrain ourselves, even me, refrain ourselves from being too picky right? Or being too judgmental. With that, with a beautiful smile, I see everyone smiling. Ek muski to banti hai, right? With that, real quick pranayam, we will end it with a beautiful, beautiful meditation. In this meditation, I don't want you to do anything. Imagine there's no music going on and just relax. If your mind wanders, come see if you can listen to your breath. That's it. No more thoughts. Closing our eyes, starting to say Om three times with a long O and a short breath, coming to Jnana Mudra where the index finger tip is connected to the ring finger. You can sit in full lotus or half lotus. Let's take two breaths in with the audible breath out. Take a deep breath in. Um, 
deep breath in. Ah. Sing Om three times. Deep breath in. Long Om. Om. Deep breath in. Om. time. Deep breath in. Oh. Holy Getting ready for Kapal Bhati for 30 counts internal organ exercise. We come to Prana Mudra. Take the ring, tip of your ring finger to the thumb. Take the tip of your little finger to the thumb. Prana Mudra helps us with our eyesight. Gently press it. Kapal Bhati is forceful breathing in and out, but the stomach goes back and front. Sitting up straight, taking a deep breath in and go. You decide the speed. That's five, four. Three, two, last one. Take a deep breath in. Breathing out, drop your chin to the chest and hold your breath. No more breathing. Squeeze your belly button to the spine. Send all your focus to squeeze your glutes, your anal glands. No more breathing. Five. Four, three, two, last one. Only unlock your chin. Do not release your breath. Release your stomach. Release your glutes. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Today, we will only do one set of Kapalpati and we'll go right away to Sheetali. For Sheetali, my dear friends, I want you to do Appanna Mudra. So, for Appanna Mudra, Take the tip of your ring finger, tip of your middle finger to the tip of your thumb. Apanna Mudra helps us to eliminate foreign matters, especially with if you have constipation. So let's press it. And guess what? It brings energy and makes our self-confidence up. With that, getting ready for Sheetli. If you have thyroid and acidity, curl up your tongue and suck in the cool air. Seal your lips and hold on to your breath only for two counts or three counts. And then keep the lips sealed and release it through the nose and your throat. Next two sets, you're on your own. Ready? One more time. Beautiful. The same way we do Shitkari too for gum disease. So connect your teeth, clench your teeth, suck in the cool air, seal your lips, hold your breath. Keeping the lips sealed. Release your breath. Next two set, you're on your own. Last one. 
Excellent, excellent. Um, to improve the oxygen level of our body with Anulom Vilom. With our left hand, we do Vayu Mudra. Take your index finger, make a circle to the tip of your thumb. Take the thumb, press it. Flip it, put it on your knees. With our right hand, we do Vishnu Mudra. Bend your index finger, middle finger, flip it. Lock the right nostril. We are going to breathe from our left. Ready? Breathe in. Two, three, four. Lock both the nostril. Four, three, two, one. Exhale right. Two, three, four. Inhale right. Two, three, four. Lock both the nostril. Four, three, two, one. Exhale left. Two, three, four. Inhale left. Two, three, four. Lock four, three, two, one. Exhale six. Count six, five, four, three, two. One, inhale, four, three, two, one, lock, four, three, two, one, exhale, left, two, three, four, inhale, left, two, three, four, lock, four, three, two, one, exhale, right, two, three, continue, four, inhale, right, two, three, four, lock, four, two, one, exhale, left, two, three, Four. Inhale left, two, three, four. Lock four, three, two, one. Exhale right, two, three, four. Inhale right, two, three, four. Lock four, three, two, one. Exhale left, two, three, four. Inhale left, two, three, four. Lock four, three, two, one. Exhale right, two, three, four. Inhale right, two, Three, four, lock four, three, two, one, exhale left, two, three, four, slowly, eyes are still closed. Getting ready for Bhastrika. Bhastrika, we do is arms up, forceful breathing, uh, up, forceful breathing in and out with arms coming from up towards our shoulder for 10 counts. Then arms come forward. Breathing in and out, coming towards your armpit. And 10 counts, our chicken wings. Are you ready? Let's go. Arms up. Ready? Let's go. Forward. Eight, nine, ten. Chicken wings. Eight, nine, ten. Second set, arms up. Ready, go. Eight, nine, ten. Arms forward. Eight, nine, ten. Chicken wings. Eight, nine, ten. Slowly releasing it. Getting ready for Agni Sar to speed up our metabolism. To speed up our metabolism, bring your hands on your knees. We take a deep breath in. As we breathe out, we lean forward. Breathe everything out and stop your breath. No more breathing. Only the stomach goes back and front without making any sound. And go. Five, four, three, two, last one. Slowly take a deep breath in and come back. Now breathe out and lean forward. Hold your breath and go. Last five, four, three, two, last one. Slowly coming back, getting ready. To improve our memory, opening up our brain cells through Brahmari. Tuck your thumb in your ears or you can press it. Index finger over your eyelid, middle finger over your nostril. So when we do the humming buzzing bee sound, we 
press our nostrils softly and we press our ears softly. Ring finger over your upper lip, pinky finger over your jawline. Take a deep breath in. Mm -hmm. Ready for set number two, making a humming, buzzing B sound. Deep breath in. Mm. Last set, deep breath in. Mm -hmm. Once you are done, slowly release your fingers. Come to Jnana Mudra, where the index finger and the tip of your thumb is connected. Closing our pranayam, preparing ourselves for a three-minute meditation by saying Om with a long, short O and a long M. To say long M, seal your lips, feel the vibration in your lips. This also helps us to open up our brain cells, sending oxygen to our brain. Take a deep breath in. Om. Deep breath in. Om. Last set. Deep breath in. Om. No more thoughts. Let the music control you. Oh, oh.
सुदापा मोरिया मंगल मूर्ति मोरिया feeling very rejuvenated feeling very achieved feeling so satisfied towards the commitment of your me time let's fold our hands and bow down to mother earth to seal our practice today slowly coming up taking a deep breath in and an audible breath out see how you feel right now rub your hands rub your palms generating the heat taking the base of your palm over your eyelid and pressing your eyelids gently now cover your face with your palms open and close and release that powerful potent energy you collected close your eyes again take that potent rub it over your glowing face all over your body let's thank each and every part of our body each and every organ of our body for letting us work out and keeping us fit with that looking down with a beautiful smile slowly opening up our eyes i thank you all for coming in and let me stop the recording